Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see by the title of this video, we're going to be discussing the Frozen 2 collection from Scentsy. So I wanted to come back and talk about this and do a post-warming video so you guys can see what my thoughts were on how these performed when warm. So everything right now is currently available, including the set like this that has this beautiful decorative gift box. So you can just go on the site and start shopping. But I did want to discuss, I made some little notes as I was warming, so I would remember what to tell you guys about the fragrances. So let's get started. Okay, so the first one I am grabbing is the North Calls Bar. And you can see I have warmed almost all of it. So the North Cause was light. It was a light performer for me. I mean, this smells light on cold. So on warm, it was not slapping anybody in the face or anything. So if you are a person that does not like loud scents, I happen to know a couple of people that do not like loud scents at all. They don't like loud perfume, air fresheners, none of that. If you're one of these people, then this bar would be for you. So that is the North Calls. It's a beautiful, fresh smelling scent. And I'll put the notes below so you can check that out because I don't think they are on the box. Oh, duh, the notes on the back of the box. How did I forget that easily? So the notes for the North Calls are sweet tangerine, berry, lily, mandarin, and that's it. Sweet tangerine, berry, lily, and mandarin. So there you have it. So very fresh, light. This whole series of bars is more on the fresh, clean, light, woodsy side. But they're just really light. And refreshing I had let my husband sniff these as soon as I got them like pulling them out the box and letting him smell it and over and over again he just kept saying it it really smells outdoorsy like they nailed that whole frozen outdoorsy type scent with this collection because it carries through from bar to bar see the next one is born to lead so here we go and out of all of these i probably just have two left and this is fresh but it's more fruity now born to lead for me this one was loud and when i say loud that's a good thing because i like stuff slapping me upside the, the head every once in a while it was loud and it was sweet. So I like this one a lot. This one was probably the strongest one. Um, there were two of them that were loud, but this one was loud. Also, the notes on this are, let's see, sparkling lemon, apple, creamy vanilla. So those are the notes for this one. Like I said, I really really enjoyed this so we've gone from kind of eh and light to bam so if you want a bar that's gonna shake things up and just really get that fragrance all up in your room and area here we go okay next we have fearless by nature and beautiful green wax two cubes of that left this one also was a loud one so this of course is a very green scent and the notes for this one are grapefruit sage and woods so for this one your sage is really prominent the sage and the woods and I, I like it a lot. It was very, you know, refreshing. I liked it. Like I said, this, I cannot stress enough the sage that is coming through. Now, I'm not saying that your house is going to smell like a kitchen with sage in it, but it it's very, very green. So if you like green, 
it almost, someone had did a video saying it reminded them of Irish Spring Soap. So we're kind of talking about that kind of green. So I like it a lot though. And I think it's worth a, a gamble if you like green scents or if you just like really fresh, clean, kind of that grass type scent, nature scents. Here you go, Fearless by Nature. Great performer. Next we have Autumn. Um, a Dance of Autumn, and we have two cubes of that left. And for me, this one, it was, it was kind of loud, but I could not smell it the next day. So that was kind of what took me by surprise about this one, because with it being loud, I was like, okay, cool, you know. But then the next day, it was just like, bam, it was just gone. I was like, but where did it go? So the positive on this, if you like to change your wax, I usually change my wax every day, every once in a while, depending on the scent that I'm warming. I might skip a day and then let it um, melt for two days. Like right now I have pumpkin roll going throughout the whole house and pumpkin roll is clearly a two-dayer. So I put it in yesterday and my house still smells like pumpkin roll now. So I was like, I'm not going to change my wax. I'm going to enjoy my pumpkin and I'll change it out tomorrow. But if you are a strict one day warmer, then this scent would be great for you because it's nice and loud on day one. And by day two, you're ready to change. And let's see, the notes for Dance of Autumn are fresh apple, autumn air, and vetiver love love this scent it is clearly fall it is so beautiful that apple is really dominant it's a great fall scent but with that touch of freshness that is going through this whole collection so there you have it a dance of autumn and the last one we have is mythic journey and blue wax Mythic Journey for me was light. Now you're not going to get strong in every collection of anything, let alone a Disney um, collection of waxes. So this is light on cold. It was light on warm to me. Beautiful scent. Um, let me give you the notes of this one. This is so convenient that they finally put the notes on the actual collection itself so you could see it and I have to go back through the website to find out what the notes are. So for this one, it is Purple Freesia, Luscious Pear, and Ocean Waves. So yeah, Freesia is dominant and the pear, the pear is kind of way in the back to me. So if you're a person that does not like pear, please don't be scared to get this one because the pear is not the dominant note in this one. Like I said, it was light. So for those of you guys that like light fragrances, there you go. I did want to give you some updates while I'm on. So for the... Um, Oh, what am I trying to think about it? Left my head already. The wax, the giant wax bars. Good God. Bricks. The bricks. All of the bricks are gone now except for vanilla bean buttercream. That is the only one that is currently still available. Now, you guys know that if you do a Scentsy Club order, that is one of the mainstay fragrances one of the OG fragrances that you can always get from Scentsy. The only difference with the holiday collection is you get decorative packaging. So you get it in a beautiful um, clamshell instead of the normal clamshell. So if you're a sucker for a pretty package, then you can go ahead and still pick that one up. I did want to let you guys know that. So all of the rest of them have gone bye-bye so that's the only one still currently available i will put a link below to take you directly to the page where you can check out 
it works. And the last thing I wanted to mention for the new warmer that's coming out in January, the Himalayan sea salt warmer, I did want to let you know that it, I think I mentioned in a previous video, it's going to be gone like that. I am doing pre-orders for you guys. So if you want it, you need to let me know, either shoot me a DM, comment below, um, hit me up on Instagram, however you want to do it. Let me know what you want, what color you want. I will go ahead and place an order so I can get the warmer for you. And then I will turn around and send the warmer to you. So that is what we are doing for that. So if you know it's something that you really want, go ahead and just let me order it for you. And then I will send it to you. A lot of consultants will offer this kind of service for you and that is because most of us have the time or we will make the time to make sure we are on that website as soon as it goes live. We are pushing the button, we're ready to go and we can get the orders in, order multiples at a time. That way we can make sure that our customers get what they want because nine times out of ten a customer is not going to be sitting there at the computer ready to go like we are so that's why we offer the service for you so the warmer comes in two colors it comes in pink which is the one that i have i will link a video where you guys can check that out it also comes in white i have seen some of the most amazing videos from scentsy consultants that got the white one and they have been using the colored scentsy bulbs that scentsy sells and you can purchase for your warmers but they have, they come in red, green, yellow, I want to say blue, or is it orange? I'll double check, and I'll also list that below, the link where you can get the colored bulbs. But, oh my God, if you get the white one, and you get the colored bulbs, then basically you have turned your warmer into four or five different warmers. It is amazing, the transformation with the colored bulb. So just keep that in mind also. So that's it everybody. I just wanted to come on really quick and do an update. I have been meaning to do this update for you guys for a minute and I kept forgetting about it. And then finally it just jogged my memory and I was like, I gotta come on here and do a post warming update on this. Give you guys the other two pieces of housekeeping regarding the bricks and the new warmer. For January. As always, thanks for watching. Please remember to thumbs up, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications. I will see you in the next video. If I don't do another video by Christmas, which I might not, I just want to go ahead and say Merry Christmas to everybody. Happy Holidays, Happy Kwanzaa, Happy Hanukkah, and just Happy Holidays. Everybody have a wonderful holiday season. And I will see you again in the next video. Bye.